authors. So according to me, the person who has given the foundation of that methodology, that this is the problem and this is my particular. So doctor, I want to ask you a thing. See, like I have written a research paper. So three of my lab mates are a part of that work. And all three of them have equal contribution. Now the thing is, when we write a paper of that work, whose name should come as the first author? Uh, thank you, first of all, uh, Chandan sir, for inviting me under your right. next video series. Uh, first of all, as your question that uh, there is a research paper and there are three authors who should be the first authored person. So before I answer this question, I would like to tell you that the rule of the thumb says that whosoever has the highest level of contribution, or you can say in a research paper, which part is very critical, Actually, mm -hmm. the person should be written as number one. Now, as you have said me with the question that all of them has uh, given the equal contribution, but still I would like to inform you that the person who has given the basic foundation of the problem, that this is a problem and this we can solve. And secondly, with the rolling stone, that this is how we can solve with this type of methodology. Because in research paper, if you're proving something and you're proposing something, the most important the people used to study is methodology. Like suppose I give you an example, suppose you're proposing a routing protocol for a particular network. So I'm not concerned with introduction or any of your results first. I'm concerned that what exactly is the protocol talking about mm -hmm. and how you're solving something. Mm -hmm. So likewise, like if three people are the authors, so according to me, the person who has given the foundation of that methodology, that this is the problem and this is my particular idea and this mm -hmm. is how we can solve. And mm -hmm. he has given some critical contribution regarding the foundation stone that mm -hmm. this is the procedure methodology and this could be our proposed architecture. Because let me tell you, if a person has made the foundation, nobody can make the foundation from the right away. Okay, mm -hmm. so no three people have the same brain that they can do that. So according to me, the person who has laid the foundation of methodology, laid the foundation that this could be a critical problem and this could be the solution. According to my eyes, that person should be placed at number one. Okay, okay. That's great, that's great. Okay, so thanks, thanks, thank you so much for this answer. Sir. Thank you.